hello my wonderful people welcome back to spice channel tv thank you for always coming out here if you're joining us for the first time please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up thank you my country people recently john okafor the nollywood actor had cried out to nigerians requesting for prayers he needs our prayers and our support Mr. John Okafor has been seriously down and also complained that uh, if care is not taken, his leg might be cut off. So he cried to Nigerians for support, you know, through prayers and other, you know, financial support and all of that. But then my country people, the likes of uh, Reno Omokri had turned this into, you know, a, a, a joke more like a, a speculation which some certain individuals have reacted now we have kanayo o kanayo who have replied reno mokri after he called out peter obi to make donations for john okafo yes kanayo kanayo is a popular nollywood actor and a producer and has criticized reno mokri for calling out Peter Obi to financially support Mr. Ibu, a popular comic actor in Nigeria, who sought help due to an undisclosed ailment, Mr. Ibu had made a public appeal for assistance. And then, Omokri in a post on his ex page challenged Peter Obi to cover Mr. Ibu's medical expenses, claiming that the actor had endorsed and campaigned for him as his preferred candidate during the 2023 general elections. And according to Vanguard, Kanayo Kanayo responded to Omokri's request in a video posted on his verified Instagram page, where he expressed empathy for their fellow actor, Mr. Ibu, noting that his family had made great efforts to support him, but now sought public assistance. So Kanayo Kanayo strongly condemned Omokri's uh, approach, considering it as unfriendly and unkind to use Peter Obi's name in this contest. He also called out another individual, Uche Madu Egu, for making a derogatory comment about the actors. He further stated that supporting a colleague in need is a personal decision and should not be manipulated or politicized. He pointed out that some people prefer to provide help privately and their contributions should be appreciated in relation to their capacities. So at this point, Mr. Ibu, who is suffering, you know, who is suffering and at the same time reached out to Nigerians for assistance, for support, for prayers. Now we've seen that Reno Mokri had turned this into a joke which according to him is not nice at all. How can he twist this around? Trying to make it, you know, to be a political call whatsoever. In don't us say not be everything that they use they play. It's not everything you use and play. Someone that is very sick, lying on a sick bed, calling out for assistance, you are dragging P2B. So this Rina Mokri's obsession and Obi is really getting out of hand. Reno Mokri's obsession and Pito, for Pito B is getting out of hand. We have a, a sick Nollywood actor who called out for help, that he doesn't want his leg to be cut off. He asked Nigerians to support him financially to undergo treatment. And at this point, some people who have made their donations have made their donations. Those who are concerned They've reached out to Mr. Ibu, but you see, we have Reno Mokri, who is always trying to poke nose in everything, and now has dragged Obi, saying uh, Mr. Ibu had supported Obi during his election, during the campaign. Mr. Ibu was there, rallying for him. So he condemned oh, Reno Mokri's uh, statements for calling out Obi, and so on. That it is such an unfriendly thing. It is wicked. How about Uche? Who talked about shame on top actors? Shame on to you too. Because you don't have any value. You just stoop yourself so low to drag your colleagues. That is not really nice now. Don't forget that what you do to others, others will surely do to you. But then, this 
you know one may wonder why reno has this um uh, this this uh, very obsession with peter obi kanayo kanayo also dragged a very controversial man who is trending on the social media space um he goes by the name very dark man for calling out top actors amid mr ibu's health challenge yes kanayo kanayo had called out this controversial media personality very dark man for tackling top nollywood actors amid mr ibu's call for help he had described this very dark man as an attention seeker adding that uh, the guy is so so shameless also called out uchi called out reno mockery why would they waste time going into you know trending issues and unleashing very verbal words how can they condemn mr ibu's plea for assistance that is like a slap in the face of his fellow actors why would he do such a thing he made it crystal clear that um mr ibu being a well-paid actor hold no water especially when faced with the harsh reality of health crisis and this health crisis can happen to anybody it can happen to any anybody doesn't matter now this very controversial uh will i call it personality very dark man had underscored that the nollywood industry should have evolved enough to have a structure a system in a place that looks out for you know uh legends like mr ibu who has been instrumental in dishing out laughter and entertainment on the silver screen the talk the tiktoker served up some food for thought suggesting that the nollywood big wigs should have smashed some money in the pension pot to provide for the knowledge for the industry's old hands that this and that at this point they don't have money he talked about mr ibu's condition so he maintained that at this point in time whereby mr ibu is facing huge challenge he doesn't have to call out you know um he doesn't have to call out mr ibu like that it is a very shameful thing to do he also uh, lambasted Reno Mokri for dragging Obi into this issue. Also, Uche for dragging the Nollywood actors. So guys, this is a very, very serious matter. But then Nigerians have reacted. Reno Mokri is an attention seeker. Now, where there no column, now there you they see him. Between Obi and Omokri, who is a criminal? Reno Mokri is the most shameless person. Reno is not a pastor chosen by God. He is deliberately attacking and mocking Peter B. Okay? Reno Mokri is not relevant again. He is just an hypocrite. Guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. So my country people, make one account mouth for this matter.